the patch for 0.9.0 is announced and it's on the 21st of July. Before that there will obviously be the beta which I will play and upload content on. But let's take a look at the patch that we have upcoming. We have 4 new achievements, 1 new challenge stage and 2 new arcana. That means there is another achievement for something that is not announced here. We have one extra character. Now I do assume that the fourth achievement that is missing here, since the other is for the challenge stage and the two arcanas, is for this character in particular. It's a bit confusing what he wrote, because he said they are saying there are three, so maybe there is some morphing going on. But I rather wonder if you can change him in the actual game, which would make the most sense, or outside of the game. Or maybe there are literally three characters, like he, he says like, oh yeah, I added one and it's actually three. Then we have some bug fixes for pentagram limit break, for gorgeous moon limit break, that it's affected by a mount. The flashing issue with gorgeous moon and pentagram, that's nice. And the rest is not too important. Now one thing I do want to mention, on the roadmap of 0.8.0, where all the characters were shown, people got these two pictures depending on certain contrasts and coloring. And it clearly shows, okay, there's a dragon head at the bottom left. People have theorized this might be Gaines Boros, a reference to him being released on that patch. But there's a character in the middle. And it's a little bit hard to say what's going on. I mean, it looks like the character has a crown. He is wearing a coat. And I would guess that this weapon could be Heaven Sword. But then again, it actually looks very different. And we are still missing two weapons. So this could be a spoiler to the new weapon being a sword-like. But it doesn't really look like a sword, actually. It looks more like the blade. And that's it. But yeah, this might be a spoiler for the upcoming character. As well as for the weapon. Don't forget to subscribe to not miss the beta content. As well as, of course, the update content. And see you there.